Hi kids! Today we will learn rounding off and that is up to millions. So, first of all, what is rounding off? Rounding is to replace the number with another one that has value approximately equal to original number but is simpler, shorter, and easier to represent and use in calculation. It makes the number less exact but simpler to calculate. Rounding off can be the nearest 10, 100, 1000, 10,000, 100,000, or even million. Here we will be learning all today. In rounding off, there are always two options. Either you round up the number or round down the number. Let's see some examples. Let's round off 45 to the nearest 10. Ten's digit here is 4. And there are two options. Either you round down or round up. Either we can round it up to next 10, that is 50, or we can round it down to previous 10, that is 40. And it depends upon the digit next to 4, that is 1's digit. If the 1's digit is 5 or more, we will round it up and if the 1's digit is less than 5, we will round it down. Here is the 1's digit is 5. So, we will round it up. So, 45 will be rounded up to next 10, that is 50. Now let's round 678 to nearest 100. Here again, we have two options, as we have to round the number to nearest 100. So, we will either round the number to next 100, that is 700, or round it down to previous 100, that is 600. And it will depend on the digit on the tens place. If the digit on the tens place is 5 or more, we will round it up. And if the digit on the tens place is less than 5, we will round it down. And here, the tens digit is more than 5, so the number will be rounded up to the next 100, that is 700. Now, let's round off 1,234 to the nearest 100. Here, the hundreds digit is 2. We have to round the number to nearest 100. So, Nearest hundred are two hundred and three hundred. Again, it will depend on the tens digit. And if the tens digit is five or more, it will be rounded up to next hundred. And if the tens digit is less than five, it will be rounded down to nearest hundred. Here, the tens digit is less than five. That is 3, so it will be rounded down to previous 100, that is 200. So, our number will be 1,200. Now let's move to next example. Now we have to round off 567,450 to nearest 1,000. Digit at thousands place is 7. So we have to round it off 7,450 to nearest thousand. The previous digit, that is 56, will remain unchanged at their places. As we have to round off this number to nearest thousand, there will be two options. Either round down to previous thousand, that is to seven thousand, or round up to next thousand. And next thousand will be eight thousand. 
and it will depend on the hundreds digit that will be rounded up or down. If the digit at hundred place is five or more, it will round up to next thousand. And if the digit at hundreds place is less than five, it will be rounded down to previous thousand. And here, the digit at hundreds place is less than five. Before number will be rounded down to previous thousand, that is seven thousand. And also we don't change the digits which are at bigger place than the digits we are rounding off. So our answer is 567,000. Now let's move to next example. Now let's round off this big number. It is 4,683,703, the nearest hundred thousand. First of all, see the digit, which is at hundred thousands place. Here, the digit at hundred thousands place is six, as the digits at bigger places will remain unchanged. So, we have to round off 683,703 to nearest 100,000. And we know we have two options. Either round up to next 100,000 or round down to previous 100,000. Previous 100,000 is 600,000 and next 100,000 is 700,000, and it will depend on the 10,000 place. If the digit at 10,000 place is 5 or more, the whole number will be rounded up to next 100,000. That is 700,000, and if the digit at 10,000 place is less than 5, the whole number will be rounded down to previous hundred thousand, that is six hundred thousand. And here the digit at ten thousands place is more than five. The whole number will be rounded up to seven hundred thousand. Now let's move on to next example. Here we have again a big number. It is 7,978,465 and we have to round it off to nearest million. The digit at millions place is 7 again. We have two options, that is either round down to previous million, that is 7 million, or round up to next million, that is 8 million. And it will depend upon the hundred thousands place digit. If the digit at hundred thousands place is 5 or more, the number will be rounded up to next million. And if the digit at hundred thousands place is less than 5, the whole number will be rounded down to previous million. And here, the digit at hundred thousands place is more than five. It's nine. So, the whole number will round it off to next million. That is eight million. Now let's take one more example. Now we have to round off three million six hundred and forty three thousand and eight hundred and forty nine to nearest ten thousand. So, first of all, see the digit at ten thousands place. The digit at ten thousands place is four. The digits at the bigger place will stay unchanged. So, we have to round off 43,849 to nearest ten thousand. That is, either round off to next ten thousand, that is, fifty thousand, or round down to previous thousand, that is 40,000. And the whole thing will depend upon the digit of thousands place. And the digit of thousand place 
is three. And we know if the digit is less than five, then we round it down. And this number will be rounded down to previous 10,000, and it is 40,000. And we do not change the digits at higher places than the digit we are rounding off. So, the whole number became 3,640,000. So kids, we learned rounding off to the nearest ten, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands, or even millions. Now go ahead and take a quiz to learn more. Bye-bye. Tootway has thousands of animated videos on math, English, and science to clear the core basics of these subjects.